So that is a great question. When you when we get the lipo mix from the pharmacy, it do, does says I am only. A lot of different medications have its recommended route. Um, this product has been tested subcutaneous as testosterone and a whole lot of other medications, and it has deemed safe to give other routes. My preference is if I'm going to have people doing injections at home, it's a lot easier to have them do a subcutaneous injection versus an IM injection, which takes a little bit more technique. And for me, my preference is to have my clients microdose. So the IM injections are good in some aspect, but for me, I like my people to have that longer threshold, that longer coverage. And when you microdose, when you do it every other day, you get more of this instead of this. And so that's the best way that I could break it down and put it to you. But it is safe to take either IM or subcutaneously. Subcutaneous is just my preference. I think it's a lot harder to teach everybody how to do an IM injection. And plus for me, you get better coverage when you do a subcutaneous. So thank you.